what's up my money bag so here's a little bit of dinners that we eat i am making some burgers Ooh, they're getting smoky let me turn this down a little bit and then a train got some corn sweet corn going back there you know we were gonna do these on the grill but i said you know what why not do them in the house the only thing i don't like is all this dang smoke cooking low and low and then I also have some pasta salad. Now, they did not have no tricolor. So, baby, I got some of this kind. And I'm going to be putting in some grape tomatoes. Some Hormel pepperoni minis. Some olives. They, did, they were pretty low on ingredients, y'all. So, I had to make it work with what they had. Some Colby and Monterey Jack cheese. I also had some mozzarella cheese, and then I'm going to be using this Italian dressing along with some of the Olive Garden dressing. Let me know. What else do y'all put in your pasta salad? This is actually the first time I'm making it. I don't like like bell peppers and stuff in it. Well, the kids wouldn't really like that, so it's just kind of basic. I have these tomatoes cut up. I'm going to go ahead and pour this in there. Go ahead and add these tomatoes. You out. I don't know if you out. It looks like you need some help. <laughs> uh, excuse you. Just adding go. in the olives. What else you need? And the pepperonis. What do you use these for? That goes in the pasta salad. You said you're helping, not dictating. Oh, my bad. I thought this was sufficient. Uh, uh, I'm making it the way I want to make it. Oh, Thank okay. you. And plus, Walmart was out of a lot of stuff. Can I hear? Nobody said eat the ingredients. Just oh. pour them in there. Oh. Okay. Oh, oh, and oh. That's yours. And oh, then, the by the way, I transferred these two over there. This pan was burning faster than this one, so went ahead and transferred them over. These are off, and they're done. And then the last thing, well, not the last thing, but we're going to add in some of that Colby Jack cheese. Oh, these are those blocks. Yes. Mmm, oh, delicious. More one? Nothing. Here goes, son. Okay. All of it? Yep. We're going to add all those in. And then a splash of the mozzarella. Oh, a mozzarella splash? Yes. And I was saying to my money bags, comment down below, what do y'all put in yours? I know that usually there's like purple onions. I was about to say oh, that. it needs more than that. You said splash. Right. So we decided to stop recording and go live. So please check out my live video for the finished product. It was time to start packing for our 14-day trip on the East Coast. And this is our extras bag for all like our shoes. I got them bagged up. Some Pampers, pull-ups, A Train's bag, and then we have this weight. Uh, how much weight is it? Is it the red one, right? Yeah. For 46. I got enough room to take some stuff off the board. So you barely cleared it. Well, I need the boy stuff in here too. Yeah, because it's 50 pounds that we're able to fly. So we are bringing how many bags? Mm -hmm. And tell them how much it costs. Oh, it's going to be about a little over $200 to check in, check in our bags. So we are staying an extensive time. So that's why we're packing so much. Also have this one as a carry-on. We have this little mini one as a carry-on. That's face, right? That's face. That's your face bag. Sorry. Yep. This is a hard thing. So and I think a piece of pillows. And because we are taking a red eye, we we have like their blankets packed in that one. Then coming over here, we have Sean and Cash's. That's another carry-on. Carry -on. This one barely cut the weight, right? It's still over. Let's it's still over. Is that 50 on the dot? Oh my gosh, don't even sneeze on it. <laughs> <laughs> I still think I should take something out to be safe though. Just yes, a bit more. yeah, we don't need no smoke. <laughs> <laughs> Just to let you all know, if we go over one pound, it's $100. Yes. And here's Aaliyah's bag. She's still working on packing. 
What's up my money bags? Okay, so let me show you how it's like to travel with a large family of seven. We'll be gone for a couple weeks, but this is what it requires. Okay, we have one big duffel bag, and mind you, each of these are barely on the cusp of being 50 pounds, which is what's allowed. We have that one, we have a carry-on backpack. This, I've had to empty like three times, me and A-Train, to try to shift my weight. Then we have A-Train's duffel bag. We have a car seat with a, what is this? It's a car seat travel bag. And then this is the strap, so that's how it's gonna look. She's gonna strap onto this. Is this considered a uh, check-in? Um, yeah. Not a check-in, but I guess carry-on, I don't know. We take it to where you're about to board the plane, and then they tell you to leave it there. So I don't know if there's a charge for that, I hope not, because this is looking crazy. We got to sanitize the car for your dad, so what do you think you're gonna do? We're going to get to the car wash still. <laughs> we need to. And then A-Train's bag. We have the new car seat. Uh, Kendrick and Faith's bag. These are going to be carry-ons. This bag right here. This is barely making the weight. That's another duffel bag with Deshaun and Cash's clothes. These are the baby's clothes. So we need to stop and get another one of these so we can carry that on. Another carry-on. Another carry-on. Another carry-on, which is like the diaper bag. And then, of course, my purse. Oh, where's Aaliyah's stuff? Uh, she got one more carry-on upstairs. So, um. Plus Aaliyah's stuff. So, it is pretty much hectic in here. It's beginning to be evening time. We're taking a red-eye flight out of here. So, yes, this is what it's like to travel with a large family. So while I was driving on the way to the airport, our freaking trunk popped open and this suitcase fell out. Our car behind us ran it over and drug it. Our laptop and some other items were destroyed. What a way to start the trip, but the devil is a lie. We weren't gonna let this hold us back. Amen? We made it to the airport. Thank God. My dad drove us here. Got all these bags. My dad dropping us off. Faith, she's strapped onto this. We got all these bags. Hello? So he fell on one of these, so that's the reason why he's crying. Oh, my baby. <laughs> Let's see how this goes. They got their melatonin. Hopefully they go to sleep. <coughs> I guess they train still back there getting the car seat checked in. We are now boarded on the plane, thank God. This flight was not too many people, so we had a few rows to ourselves, although we still chose to sit together. And she's getting snuggled in. Large family flying. There's Deshaun. Bro, everyone's recording. <laughs> this is how it's like to fly a large family. We are taking off. Faith, the kids are all excited. Here we go. I definitely recommend a red eye flight if you're flying with so many kids because you can go to sleep. And when they wake up, it is time. It's daytime. It's morning time. So here they are, still excited. Faith, she is no bother. She's like, let me get my stuff out, my little coloring stuff, and get to this flight. <laughs> Here's the beverages. I got a crayon apple, of course. They give you a little snack, which was like the Biscoff cookies, and soda, water, coffee, tea, whatever you needed. So it was a pretty chill flight. We got one drink and a couple snacks. They also had USB cords to charge and they had actual charging power cords along with some Wi-Fi so you can watch the movies or get online for entertainment. It is now morning time. What a beautiful day. It is cloudy up in the skies. Thank you, 
Lord for this beautiful day and for letting us make it there safely. We're now flying over Washington, D.C. Look at the city. Yes, all the nice sightseeing places that people go to. We made it. Here we are at Ronald Reagan Washington National Airport. Large family of seven, five kids. We conquered. We are here. We're tired, but thankful to be here. We are all checked into the Gaylord at National Harbor. So let's do some exploring. This is a site of the hotel. This is the Gaylord in Maryland. So nice. So it's like a little cottage town down there. Mom! In the water. Mom! 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 You come up, they have this old style phone. I love it. And in the elevator, you need your room key card to go up and down. There's National Harbor, the Capitol Wheel. There will be plenty of videos coming on the Elliott Family of Seven channel as well as my channel. Thank you for watching. Stay blessed and highly favored. Peace.